So the Minnesota Police Department came out and said that the Minneapolis Police Department has been doing racial discrimination for years. You think? Rest in peace to Prince. But um, back in the day, I, once I got hip, and I actually been to Minneapolis, I went to Minneapolis and through there, I got hip that First Avenue and thing in Purple Rain wasn't real. It was a kumbaya affair. Because they were racially divided. It wasn't the the We Are the World. Even though he didn't participate, he got a song on this on that album for the Tears in Your Eyes, but he wanted to participate. But he very much had a Michael Jackson type of theme of trying to sell Minneapolis as his utopia and is this free and love and all but you know, all that. There ain't been nothing but that. Cause since his death in twenty sixteen, which is still Suspect as I'll get out. That's another video, another story. But anyway, to Castillo, to George Floyd, to White, the killings and lynchings of black folks in Minneapolis has been alarming. The no knocking, the whole thing has come to fruition. So now the Minnesota Department says Minneapolis racial discrimination has, has counted, has said that they do that. Well, we kind of figured that out. But don't all these police departments in America with three Ks do that, though? I mean, really? Would you just have to pick on just them? Don't they all do it when they see somebody black? Because they don't really think you belong, even though you are a United States citizen, and you pay taxes, and you're born and bred here, and you have Social Security, and they... But let me stop making sense. Let me stop making sense. This is what they do. This is what they want. You know. What do you do when you say defund? Well, George Floyd's girlfriend... Say, give me a refund. Well, it's true. It's true. It's embarrassing. But you don't have any leaders to speak on it. Joe Biden ain't nowhere around. Trump ain't nobody was around. Nobody ain't say nothing about it. Nobody said nothing about it. They just sit there and look the other way. It's open season on black folk. That's the bottom line. And they've been allowed to do that. And uh Prince, ironic, before he died, he did speak out about the uh, police and he talked about the slave catchers. He talked about it. And I remember Morris Day talked about it. But I'm just telling you, it ain't no purple rain in Minneapolis. It's more like purple pain. They got some real issues and they are close to Mississippi and down south. And they got a good old boy network. And it's there, but it's all over America with three Ks. Ain't nothing new. Ain't nothing new. Well, please hit like, subscribe, welcome, thoughts, and comments, and I do respond. Thank you. Wash your hands. Keep your mind clear. Watch out for another. And they all need to be investigated because the way they would, uh, with 400, 500 years have done black folks in America with three Ks, they all need to be under investigation. I'm out.